Hey, hey, hey guys, it's me, My Reborns, and I'm back with another video. Today is the same day, literally like the same time. I just fin finished another video. It's April 11th, it's currently 5.18 p.m. I have Claudia here for you all. I just finished a video, I finished recording a video on my phone. Now I'm on my camera because... I'm doing something on my phone right now and I was just doing Claudia's hair right and I was just saying in my last video if you haven't watched it go ahead and watch it how Claudia's hair was so like versatile like you can literally do anything it moves in any way and so I was just playing with it while um something on my phone loads and then I was like why don't I record me actually like doing it so first I started let me back up a little bit for you guys okay so first I know it looks like he has a ball spot he doesn't first I started with the comb no water and I'm just like literally ugh, is it blurry please don't be blurry camera please let me see if I can lay him down like this No, it's blurry. Okay, so I was just, his hair is curved. It's curvy hair. So I was just moving it along like this, like to the side. Kind of like, mm, a lot of you guys probably not going to know what this is, but if you get your hair, if you have curly hair and you get your hair so pressed and you wrap it that's kind of like what i was doing so yeah when you get your hair so pressed or flat ironed you like wrap it you go all in the same direction you well you comb the hair all in the same direction it's i believe it's the way i'm combing it is how you're supposed to do it And then I kind of was liking it like this. But I did want to show you guys his hair because like I knew his hair like moved in any direction that you wanted it to. But like I literally was not expecting this or expecting me to like it. Let me fix you guys this angle. I'm not liking the way you guys are sitting. Alright, how is that for you all? I hope you guys like this angle better. You guys can probably actually see what I'm doing now. Isn't that right? The camera will focus. Okay. So, I'm just moving the hair like this. I'm not sure, but I do want to display it better because I don't like how it looks, you know, like he's bald or anything. So, I don't want it to really look like that, but I'm just playing around with it. Like I said, I didn't spray any water in his hair, and it looks so good. I just started doing it. He didn't have hardly any tangles or naps. He only had, his hair got tangled probably twice when I was combing it out. And he has a lot of hair, so that's expected for it to get tangled. But it didn't fall out or anything. You guys see, I'm combing his hair. His hair is not falling out or anything. Um, he is sealed. His hair is sealed, I should say. Oh my gosh, that video is taking forever. But guys, I don't know how I want to do his hair. Look at it. Can you guys see? He looks like a real baby with his hair. Because, you know, when newborns come out, their hair is so, so silky like this. So silky. Just goes with the flow. Look at that. I want to bring you guys closer to see. And his hair is so soft, guys. So soft. He's definitely... Well, I only rooted three babies. Three. And him and the toddler I did, they're my favorite. The toddler I did, hers a little too pluggy. Um, she had definitely way more than a couple of hairs. She had a lot of hairs per hole, of course, because I wanted it thick and I wanted it full. And she had a big head. And she was my second toddler, or my second baby I rooted. So, you know, 
it's gonna they're not gonna be micro rooted or is it mono or is it both i don't know they're not gonna have one hair per hole um like as, as i am a beginner and um especially for the prices they're not gonna have all of that so but this is his hair let me see something guys Yeah, this is his hair, how it's rooted. And um, super soft. Can literally do anything with it. Oops, he fell. Okay, guys, you could probably see Zaire back there. I just did a video with him. Um... But yeah, guys, his hair can go anyway. I just really wanted to get on here and tell you guys that and show you guys his hair. I never really stopped and actually, like, play with his hair before because, like I said, I try not to hold or play with the baby. So I never actually did any of this until um, the video that I was making before. Guys, it's so cute. I love his hair. I love that it's long like this, too. I love babies with, like, a lot of hair. Just a personal preference, you know? Like, look at this. I just want to show you guys the back. <laughs> so cute. Can you guys see? So cute, guys. I don't know what I want to do with the front, though. It's not the back that I'm having problems with styling. It's the front. How do you style baby's hair? I try to root it um, in a way that it could be styled. Oh, okay, okay. I'm kind of liking this. Kind of liking that. Let's put that back over here. Grab some hair from the back. It's like comb over this a little bit. And then same thing with this. But I'm kind of talking to myself right now, guys. <laughs> Sorry. Just, well, thinking out loud, I should say. Not really talking to myself. Just thinking out loud because you guys are t kind of here. Right, guys? Oh, guys, the videos for the summer is going to be amazing. They're going to be so much better, and I can't wait for you all. Oh, he has so much hair. I can't wait for you all to see them. So definitely stay tuned for the summertime. Those videos are going to be Chef's Kiss Immaculate, which is probably why I'm not going to be posting a lot when I get out um, during the summertime because they're just going to be so good, guys. I can't just be giving them all out but no i am actually gonna be really busy in the summer so that's why i'm not gonna post a lot but the videos are going to be so good watch me say this and then the videos are bad no i'm kidding i'm going to definitely give it my all um and we're going to be doing some different videos instead of me sitting down and talking and doing changing videos because i personally love changing videos but not many of you do. So we're going to get back into our role play videos. Even though when I brought you guys a role play with Mr. Chandler Wandler, that video did not eat. <laughs> if you guys don't know what that means, it's a, uh, I guess you could say slang. But the video, I'm saying the video did not do well. And um, it did not do as well as I thought it would. It like, it flopped. Bad. Flopped equals bad. It flopped. So... That's why I'm scared. I'm scared to take out that much time and actually, you know, do the roleplay videos and they're not doing too well. I don't know what I'm doing with his hair now. I'm just playing with it. Maybe we can do like a little comb over. I don't like comb overs on people that are not babies. <laughs> Older people, I should say. Well... The older people kind of look nice with it, but I don't know what I'm saying. I like comb-overs, I guess. I don't know. I'm just going to stop talking now. What's your guys' favorite hairstyle on the babies? I actually like mohawks, and I I do them. I would do them on Eilina. I should do a baby mohawk on Eilina. I think I really like mohawks is because I had a mohawk when I was little. Let me rephrase that. It wasn't like... My hair was shaved on the side, but I had like a braided mohawk. I always had my hair in like braids. And um, 
it was in like a mohawk and like one time I got my name on the side it said Maya like she literally braided Maya on the side and on the other side I think it was just like braided designs in the middle it was curly to make a mohawk so if you guys don't know what a braided mohawk is that is that so um yes that's his hair I'm just gonna leave it like that but it was very fun playing with his hair and holding him not to put him back down and not pick him up until I do a video with him <laughs> that's so sad so sad and um I do wash my hands before I hold and touch the babies especially when doing their hair guys because the oils on your hands can get like on their hair and their vinyl and things like that so to make sure your babies are always staying nice and clean and nice and safe you guys see how his hair slicked down no water guys this mohair is great i will definitely be using it again when i want to do you know straight hair for the babies but um for the most part i am going to be doing curly hair babies but i thought the straight hair was perfect well i already had it before i even got claudia's kit and thought about painting claudia and so that's the main reason why i used it and plus it just made sense since this baby is a newborn like literally straight out <laughs> little one day old baby so that's also why i did straight hair look how cute guys his hair is so so good i wish i would have ruined it better but you know you live and you learn oh look at him he looks so real okay should we do should that be the thumbnail mm, look at those scratch mitts ends. okay okay look at that oh hi oh can you focus please focus 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 please oh my goodness so cute guys look at him Look at the little baby. This baby can be yours, guys. Um, all of the ones I painted, I don't know. It's it's hard to choose like an actual favorite, but because they're all so different and unique. Like Scarlet has more details than both Sweet Pea and Claudia, and so I love um Scarlet, but Scarlet's hair. I don't want to say her hair is horrible or horrendous, but I wish that I would have did better on her hair. Because if I did better on her hair, she probably would have been so. Um, but if I just did a scarlet bald or did better on her hair, scarlet would probably be my favorite. Her details are immaculate. And then Claudia, of course, has this wonderful hair. And I love Claudia's skin tone, but I don't like Claudia's eyebrows. And um, I think I want to gloss Claudia's lips because Claudia's lips are not glossed. Um, but I love Claudia's skin tone and I love the veins. I feel like, at first, I felt like I did too much for the veins and too heavy, but I, I like them. I like that you can see them through her hair right here because this vein leads up into right here in her hair. And you can actually see it. I like that. And then Sweet Pea. Oh, my precious Sweet Pea. Sweet Pea would have not even been a boo-boo baby if I didn't mess up on Sweet Pea's leg. I love Sweet Pea. I love the glossy look that I did on the mouth and the eyelids and the fingernails. I love that. Love Sweet Pea's skin tone. Um, the only thing is Sweet Pea does have the boo-boo on his leg and then on the back of his head because I was going to root hair. But nobody contacted me about rooting hair. I still might. Still might not. But if I put hair on Sweet Pea, Sweet Pea will be so cute remember guys if you could buy sweet pea i can root hair for you for free for free i can root hair for you it will be my style i've already have the hair it is synthetic hair it's not human hair i have the hair is synthetic and um it's curly as black i can root that hair for free on um sweet pea but i will be rooting my way and how i want to so that's probably the downside of it all if you don't even want to use the hair you can send me the hair you want me to use to root him with and I would do that as well for free you just have to buy the hair and get it sent to me but um yeah also before I go I do want to say this one last thing if you guys buy my baby at a discounted price they won't be going home with you know a huge box opening they will be going home um 
and a sleeper wrapped in a blanket with an, one additional outfit. And of course, you guys know me, I may or may not throw in some goodies. Maybe a bottle, maybe a passy. I may throw in a few extras, even at a discounted price. You guys never know. I just have to go through my stash and see what I have. So you can always make an offer. The babies just won't be going home with as much stuff as they would have if you paid um, the actual price. But at a discounted price, they can go home at a discounted price. And they just won't be going with a lot of stuff. Alright guys, I wish I would have did better on Sweet Pea's, I mean not Sweet Pea, on Claudia's eyebrows, guys. That's like the downfall of Claudia. That's the downfall of Claudia. Alright guys, that's pretty much it for this uh, video. If you guys, oh, I'm about to close without promoting socials again. Well, you guys should probably be following me on Instagram if you have an Instagram. Go ahead and follow me at my underscore reborns. Look at him. So precious. Let's take off the middens real quick. Um, I am on Reborns.com selling some babies under Melanated Baby. Oh, yeah. I didn't do too great on the hands either. Now that I'm looking at them. I didn't do too good on the hands. Now that I'm looking at them. They have like a lot of paint in the creases. and Yeah, I didn't do too good on the, on the hands. And I do have a membership if you guys want to join. Everything that I stated is linked below in the description. Alright, if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below anything you want in the comments, including video requests. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, what are you doing? Click that subscribe button. Also, ring that bell so you guys will not be notified when I post another video. And I will talk to you guys later. Alright, me, Claudia, and baby Zaire back here that's peacefully sleeping is out. Bye, and thank you so much for watching.